Let's get it. heard feminism is spreading there like i've heard that do you not find that to be true the harder society and the harder the life is as a whole the, the longer it's going to take for feminism to spread feminism only exists in a vacuum of an easy life if you're living in a society like india where life is hard feminism disappears because the harder life is the closer people naturally revert to their gender roles right so in countries where life is harder, feminism can't take hold because feminism can only exist in a vacuum of a very privileged life. I'm sure there's some kid in India who didn't get laid off some chick and he's complaining she's a feminist. There's a bunch of dumb shit, right? But, but, but I think the world is going to get a lot harder. I think the world is cyclical. I think it's been easy for a while. I think hard times are coming. And when hard times come, people are going to naturally revert to what gives them the highest chance of survival, which is gender roles, right? I have the best chance of survival being a man and a woman has the best chance of survival being my Everything is pent up against us. So stop believing in everything that is around you. These jobs, all this educational system, this healthcare, these, this law, all of this is not made for you. You were never meant to live this life. And when people speak out about this, they end up getting killed, locked up, and y'all not seeing it. How? How are you not seeing this happen? And nobody cares. We need to have that same type of energy that Harriet Tubman had. Get out of this system. Why? Why are we still working their jobs? Why are we still living these lives that they have organized for us? You are a god. You are a goddess. Inside of a matrix. Inside of a Out of whack with how men think. This is why you can't get what you want from us because you're valuing something up here that is a used vehicle with a lot of miles. Okay. Just because you hand washed it. You were 20 year old hot. You had 20 year old wound. You had 20 year old body count. You had 20 year old trauma. You had 20 year old experience. That's what we value. That's all it comes down to for us. <sighs> but don't you feel like with those Everything, experiences, a person can stop. add value to no. their lifetime? Men value your youth, your fertility, your purity, femininity, submission, ability to cooperate, and fitness. And all of that is at your highest in your youth. The older you get, the older you get. No product gets more expensive with time and use. Have you ever been to the pawn shop? Yeah. All right. You ever take something you really value to the pawn shop? And did that hurt your feelings when they told you how much it was worth? Yes. I was like, what? Yeah. That's you. We the pawn shop. <laughs> so, you want a top earner to accept a divorcee with three kids. He gets no children from you. And all he gets is the part of your free time for 100% of his monogamy. Does that sound like a fair deal? Yes. In fucking sane. Does, does no. Buy a dog and die alone because you keep talking about someone and we already established we weren't going to do that. But see, that's your ego. To quit your full-time job. Would you be willing to quit your full-time job to work, go work part-time for your man? Quit your full-time job to go work part-time for your man. And then get, and then from there, likely get promoted to wife. And overwhelmingly, women with Women who had a vision for a future were saying, hell yeah, eight to five for a job I don't like. I would much rather work eight to 12 for my man or, or one to five for my man. Why is this important? Because so many women today, so many women today can't, can't grow up. So many women today are stuck. Just like guys need to continue to develop. So many women today are still said it. You don't rape people who are married out of respect. Thank you, Deshaun. Deshaun is the person that transcribes and gives you the chapters. When I find out a woman is married, especially a woman is married, still married and has children, I leave it alone because she's off limits. That's the way I was raised. My opinion doesn't matter. Her husband opinion matters. I can think you are a three, but if your husband married you, I have no right 
I won't say right. I'm out of bounds to just do that. And you guys know, if you watch me across the board, I tend to back away. And only when kind of asked, and in general, when somebody's married, I don't delve too much into their situation unless they're probing and asking questions about it. Solely reaching out to a female because she's 22, and I know she hasn't had previous relationships to change her mind and think all not a certain type of way, then that's kind of weird. Like Because that experiences <laughs> tend to make women build a wall and act a certain way towards men and be more combative. You have to get into the space where we allow men to actually have preferences mm -hmm. without always trying to shame them and mm -hmm. trying to assume sure. that they meant something that they may and not have meant. Like, you get what I'm saying? So, yeah, like, yeah, like, being bottom of the barrel. Not only do they not respect the wives, but then they call the wives pick me. Right, ex right, exactly. They so, don't respect so, so, the wives, yeah. but they want all this respect. But yeah. a woman who wants to be a wife, a housewife, who wants to be submissive, yeah. they want to holler. They talk about Kevin Samuels. They shame those they, women. They're excited, mm -hmm. Kevin Samuels, when he dies. When he oh, passed. no, they're yeah. excited because yeah. they discovered the stuff he talked about with men yeah. and how he could try to get men together. And I, and I spoke about it because he was a personal friend of mine. But you don't respect us, but then you want all this disrespect, but your is open for consumption. Like, no, <laughs> you don't respect a wife. You'll be ready to be a side chick. You will take that man's money. You will steal his. You will steal him from his wife. You will do whatever it takes to get a dollar. And mm. because your mind is degraded and your mind is gone and your mind has been snatched into hell, you're Middle Earth. I'm gonna make it a long story short, bro. I'm not an asshole for telling this girl that I don't give a fuck if her and her kids are outside cold. I live in Detroit, Michigan. I chased this girl from when I was 14 up until I was about like 21. She never like really gave me the time of day. She always thought I was a joke because of the type of dude that I am. You know, like I don't smoke, I don't drink, you know, I don't go all like that. I go to work, I go home. I play video games, I like anime, that's like so she never really gave me a chance like that. But she know I always have my own car and my own place and everything. I, I wake up at like four in the morning and she talking about some, hey, I know you don't I know you hate me, but like like me and my kids about to be out on the street, whatever, whatever. Can I come over there until I find a shelter? And I'm looking around like what, what did you ask me that? Hell no, you can't come over here. We had a whole argument and I just ended up conversation like i don't know about you or your kids those are not my kids and those are not my problems get all my inbox am i really given what women want out of a relationship women don't know what they want ah here we go they don't the women think they want things and then they get them and they leave the dude women don't have a clue what they want i want a guy who's sweet and sensitive and takes care of my needs and thinks about me but but they're all out there none of you are with them why because women don't want that women don't actually want that women want to be with a man they respect women are only going to enjoy the time with and end up feeling in love with a man they genuinely respect and unfortunately to be respected some of the qualities are detrimental to the overall relationships let's say happiness i know loads of women who are with a dude they hate but they respect him like I, oh, he makes me so mad but he's the g and they stay with him as opposed to the woman who's like well he's so nice to me but you know and leaves